All right, welcome back, everybody. Like I said, uh, we're going to take a short little break. Uh, we are joined by Matt Hine uh, from Dominate the Cage. Uh, he's on the phone. Matt, welcome to the show. How's it going, bro? Hey, it's going great. Nice to be talking to you. Right on. Now, uh, where are you calling in? Uh, where are you calling in from? We're all the way from Indianapolis, Indiana. Indianapolis, Indiana. Okay, now tell us a little bit about. Um, Tell us a little bit about uh, what it is that you guys do. Uh, it's called Dominate the Cage. It's it's obviously fight wear, but it's not for profit? Yeah. I think it's the only one out there that is non-profit, completely non-profit. Okay, so you thought it would be a good idea to start a business that doesn't make money. Explain that to us. Like, how does it work? Who does it benefit? It's just a hobby of mine. Um, it was founded purely on my love of MMA. Um, I've been training for five years. And along the way, I've met a lot of people with the passion for MMA and talented in the sport, but they couldn't always afford it, like the gym membership, the equipment, or even the gas money. Right. So um, I wanted to do something about that and help them out where I could by selling shirts and giving them the money to help them out. Okay, now um, uh, we're joined on the phone by, uh, by Dominate the Cage. It's Matt Hine. Uh, Matt, tell us, um, were you a wrestler growing up? Did you play football? Have you been fighting your whole life? How did you get into, this, into the sport of MMA? Um, I'm 23 right now, and at age 18, I actually started Muay Thai. And from there, I just kept wanting to learn more and more, and I wanted to learn the ground, so I started Jiu-Jitsu. And from there, I just kept loving it. All right, fantastic. So um, what are, who are some of the fighters that you guys uh, sponsor, for instance? I mean, they're just they're local guys mostly, but uh, they're all around uh, around America and even some in Australia. But I mean, check out my site; they're all up there. That's the good thing about our site. We do bios of the individual fighters and videos of them, and we help them out any way we can. And uh, the website is dominatethecage.com. Yep. Okay, and uh, I noticed that you sell, uh, what is, yeah, I know there were uh, shorts on there, uh, there's some t-shirts, there's some hats. Uh, how do you go about uh, your designs? Who comes up with the designs? Is that your gig or what? Um, I give it to my designer, and he's a really great designer. He's actually on my sponsor page, and he's from Six Shit Designs, and he's a great guy, and he helps me out all he can. Right on. So, um, are are you? Uh, what is the game plan? Uh, how, if I wanted to uh, be sponsored, how would I uh, go about doing that? Just hit me up. I'm on the website or on MySpace, which you can get to from the website also. Email me. It's going to be me you're talking to, so you can get with me right there. Okay, and then, um, I mean. Uh, you're fighting every single day. Are you training? I mean, are you trying to be an MMA uh, star that's going into the UFC, or are you just doing this for exercise? What's your, what's your take on this? Mostly for fun. I mean, I'm gonna. I've done a few Muay Thai fights, but I've never had an actual MMA fight. Um, I really want to get in there and get some before it's too late and everything. But I'm not looking to get a career out of this. It. More like just a hobby of mine. Okay, um, is is there a pretty big scene in uh, in Indianapolis as far as the uh, MMA scene goes? Like, what gym do you train at, for instance? Um, I actually train with Marcelo, and he's actually trained um, No Guerra. You know him, right? And uh, actually, Chris Lytle has a gym right next door. I mean, there's a lot of gyms around here. It's pretty big here. Right on, right on. Was there uh, anything else that you wanted to tell us before we go to commercial break? Um, I mean help us out, get some shirts. I mean, it's going to go to good use. It's going to go to fighters. I mean, it's going to help gym fees, gas money. Um, I love to go to fights. We've been out in Arizona even. We've traveled that far to watch fighters. I mean, I love supporting them any way I can, so any help or ideas would be great. All right. Well, Matt, uh, stay in touch with us. I'll try to help you any which way I can. If you got any new products coming out, or you got new fighters, you just want to shout out and say, "Hey, your show sucks." Anything like that, uh, be sure to holler at us. Thanks a lot. All right, Matt. Uh, that's Matt from Dominate the Cage. When we come back, we will be joined by the Bully Beatdowns, Ryan Kespin. <laughs> 